if you are not stretched by your dream, it's not worth it. Think about that. The people I know, the people who are really high influencers and high performers, like you seated here, like you online, here's what I know about you. You're, you want to be moved by a dream that's big. JFK, when he stood in Rice Stadium and said, hey, we're going to put a man on the moon by the end of the decade, his dream was epic. And because his dream was epic, it motivated people to move and take action. Too many times we have a small dream. And because of that, nobody cares. Nobody's motivated. Think about Tony Shea. You know Tony Shea of Zappo Shoes? Imagine in the early 2000s and late 90s when he told his team, hey, what we're going to do is we're going to start a shoe company that's online. Is that, is that nuts or not? And you know what? Here's what else we're going to do. Because people can't actually try on the shoes, we're going to pay for shipping there and back. Now, doesn't that sound nuts? What about Tom's shoes? You ever seen Tom's shoes? Hey, we're going to buy a pair, and then when people give us the money, we're going to take some of the profits and then buy a pair in Uganda. Guys, the dreams that we Uber, Uber. Do you, do you, realize, do you realize that Airbnb right now, Airbnb, a 10-year-old business, do you realize this? I'm told is about $10 billion, and I hear Hilton is only $90 billion, and they've been around <coughs> for about 100 years. Think about that. Think about how nuts that is. It probably started with a guy saying, you know what? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be in town. I wonder if I blow up my mattress and rent it, rent my house. You think anybody will do it? Now today, Airbnb is amazing. See, all these dreams, that are inside your head and my head and inside your heart and my heart, what they need is they need a structure.